Take one. Hi, I'm Mark. And I'm Rob. We're Faker Modo. And you're watching All the Rage TV. It's not your first time in Paris. What's your feeling tonight? Uh, yeah, we're really excited actually. Um, we played here a while ago. Oh, when was it? Was it last year? It was no. about a year ago, I think, wasn't it? Was it? Or was it this year? I'm not sure. No, it wasn't this year. It was one last year on one yeah. day. I think Maybe. Oh, what? one year and one day. Oh, there you go. Exactly. Oh. <laughs> well, you know well, I was close. You know better than we do. Um, yeah, we're really excited, aren't we? Like, yeah, it should be cool. Um, last time we were here, it was a really good show. Like Quite a lot of people, a great reaction. And um, well, we've come back, and people are already in there buying stuff, and you know, looking forward yeah. to the show. So yeah, we're we're excited. French audience, yeah, really good, aren't they? Yeah, great. great. People are. I think they appreciate that you've come from the UK and yeah. uh, if you've travelled over to play here, and so people like seem to be up for it, which is good. It's great. We yeah. like the French people. Yeah. Favorite song at the moment is one of our songs called A Different World. It's uh, it's going to be on our new album next year. It's really easy to play as well, which is nice. Like yeah, it's quite. It's, it's not that easy to sing though. No, no, yeah. But it's it's good fun and it's new and it's like yeah, it's different to our so kind of different to some of our older stuff. So it makes it more exciting. Do you have a ritual before to go on stage? Just jump around a lot, don't we? Warm before, up. Before he said. Yeah, before. Yeah, jump oh, around. Oh, sorry. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, jump yeah. around, warm up. That's what I do. We all we make it. Yeah, we all we all make sure we stretch a lot, you know, because yeah. um, otherwise you just ache so much. We just, yeah, warm up, do some like vocal warm ups, stretch, jump around, yeah. get ourselves kind of psyched up for the show. Yep. That's about it, really, nothing in particular. You will release a new album next year? Yeah. yeah. Uh, what can you say about it? So it's the best thing we've ever done to date? Yeah, yeah. It's, it's, uh, we're really happy with it. We, we've, we're proud of it. We think it's good. Um, it's, to us, it's way better than anything we've ever done, yeah. like Rob said. Um, it's slightly more mature, yeah, I'd say. Definitely. Yeah, definitely. Like, The last release we did was 2008, in September 2008, yes. which is a long time, you know? Very long time, it's only three years. And even then, some of the songs on that release were quite old, and the release took a while to come out. So everything we've been playing is, is quite old, you know? So mm. the difference, the change in music and sound is, it's not, it's not drastic. It's not massive, it's just better, isn't it? It's just like, yeah. Better good. songs, you know? Um, as I say, more grown up sound, like yeah, all that kind of stuff. It's, it's a classic, bands always say it, but it's what happens, you know, as yeah. you get older, you... Uh, Write better songs. <laughs> yeah, and you grow up as musicians and yeah. as a band and you know each other better and all that kind of thing. So. Yeah. What is your best memory in Fake Commodore? Either Download 2009, Download Festival, we played that. Either Headlining the Tent at Sonosphere in 2010, good. that's that just gone. Good. Or getting nominated for a Crank Award, probably. Yeah, I'd say one of those three things, highlights, like, isn't it? the three highest things that we've done that we've had great times at is, yeah, I mean the Krang Awards we didn't we didn't win but we got nominated, got nominated which was great. You know, it was nice to be to be considered there. What is your worst memory? Oh, God. the day Rob joined the band. Worst well, rough. All right. <laughs> no, um, seriously. Um, I think of bad memories. I mean, I remember we went on tour once when I was. I mean, I'm 22 now. I was 17, I think. I was 17 or 18. We did a little, uh, did a little tour ourselves, about five days, and then um, I got really ill the day before we went on tour, and I was just ill for the whole thing, just like white. I couldn't, I could barely play, but we had went on tour for like a week. Haven't we That had was my what, worst? What was like our worst show ever? I'm sure we've had some worst show shows. ever. Yeah. Um, I don't know. Yes. I've had a few bad ones. <laughs> yeah, I can't really remember like um, my worst memory. Most of it's good. <laughs> Most, Most of your bad ones are when you lose your voice, aren't they? There's yeah, been, been a couple of shows where your voice is just gone. Yeah, just and gone. I have to stop or cut the set short once. I cut We did the set four short. songs on time. Yeah, that yeah. was the worst. What is the most strange gift uh, you received from a family? We got oh, yeah. a cake, but it wasn't just a cake. It was a cake with all of us, like photographs of us, printed on there. Yeah, there um, two of them made as well. She made two. Yeah, she made two cakes, and she yeah. brought the she brought the cake to us. It was it was nice, but it was strange, you know. Yeah. And um. She gave us like these pieces of cake without without us on there. And she was like, "Oh, here's your cake." And I was really? like, "Oh, great!" I was just about to eat it, and then it was just my face smiling yeah. back at me, and I was like, "All oh, right." 
Okay. Yeah. Really weird. So that was a bit strange. Uh, I can't really that's think cool. of it. It tasted really nice, I thought. Yeah, it was a good cake. That's so hard. Okay. Thanks. Yeah. Yeah. Keep in touch with us. Yeah, Come I mean, on Facebook and MySpace and Twitter. Yeah. Follow us and uh, keep in touch because we love to talk. Be some big stuff happening soon. So yeah, we've got a few news. changes. A few changes. Exciting things coming up. Merci beaucoup. Oh.